Working off of feedback from my previous video explaining how the Alt-1 toolkit was extremely helpful, I decided that I should probably show you guys how helpful the tool actually really is and what my favorite application is for it. Now my favorite application is going to be the Clue Scroll Solver, and I will show you guys exactly why. The Clue Solver will allow you to do Celtic Knots within seconds and the slider puzzles generally within minutes depending on what your intervals are set at, but we'll get into that later on the video. I do not use the tool for the slider puzzles though personally as I feel I can get them done faster, but for the purpose of this video I will be showing that for people who may be struggling with the slider puzzles. First off, the Celtic Knot Solver. Simply load up the Clue Solver function on your toolbar and click Unlock. Once you do this, numbers will appear on the arrows indicating which ones to move and how many times. Simply follow what it says and your Celtic Knot will unlock. If it doesn't read properly, you may have to press the Alt key and the 1 key at the same time while inverting paths to get your answer. And yes, it really is that simple to unlock a Celtic Knot puzzle. As you would have seen in the background footage, it unlocking in roughly 10 seconds. Next is the slider puzzle, which is in the same app as the Celtic Knot Solver. Click on the slide and then the cog to make it open will appear. You're going to want to set up exactly how mine is and then select the unlock button at the very top. Follow the white boxes that move around on the screen and click wherever they go to unlock a slider puzzle. Now the only reason I do not use this is because if you notice in the background I will make a couple of errors and that is because the slider puzzle in game, not the application, actually does lag sometimes. And this can simply be fixed by adding in a higher interval within the settings that you went into before, but I personally prefer to do the slider puzzles on my own as I became fairly alright at doing them, but I know for some of the beginner people who are trying to solve clue scrolls of the hard and elite variants, maybe they will want to try to use the clue scroll puzzle solver. Those are my two most used functions on the Alt-1 Toolkit, and if you have any questions on this or any other apps in the kit, feel free to ask below as always. But that's going to do it for me. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you in the next one.